that's something I ain't never seen before. That's um, you you would you did this guy proud. Okay, I know I was saying next week it's time for Terrifier 2, I'll watch Terrifier 2, I'll give this clown guy another chance, here's the thing, I don't wanna, I don't wanna, another time, alright, I'm not saying I don't wanna forever, but 2 is enough, and uh, I I just, look man, I don't wanna, alright, that's it, that's all I gotta say. We can return to the the world of Art the Clown next year. Maybe when, you know, after Terrifier 3 drops and is on streaming as well, then I could watch Terrifier 2 and 3. But, like, two in a row, I think that's my limit for this series. And, and yeah, I just don't want... So, I did also promise that I might drop another newish uh, flick to surprise you folks. And uh, you clicked on it, and here we are. I'm not even, like, setting up a surprise because, I mean, you saw it. It's in the title. It's right there. It's In a Violent Nature. Um, this movie just dropped on uh, on um, digital to rent, and um, I missed it in the theaters. I really wanted to see it in the theaters. I missed it. And so I'm going to watch it here with y'all. And I've been really interested in this movie, actually, for, for a while since I first, like, got word of it. Um way back like maybe a year ago just the concept of a movie where you get to follow the 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 slasher instead of following the victims um it's been done before but in this case the slasher being somebody like a jason or a michael it's interesting because what what do they do like if you follow the slasher in a movie like scream you get to see them take off the mask and oh they get to you know can i that's cool that's that's great that's been done actually but to do it for someone who is faceless no voice it is just a pure walking mass of evil that's fascinating what does what does what what's Jason doing in in all his downtime? You know what's he what what what's Michael doing when they're just walking around? That's what we're gonna find out today, and I'm really I'm really interested in that. And uh, yeah, if you want to see the full uncut reaction to this one uh, and all the other movies I've covered and all the shows I've covered and just everything, Patreon.com/slash/bsmovies for only a dollar a month, you can be just like my violent nature in crowd boy got through that one with the skin of my teeth hannah nick kev battle sister cat george ken greg and uh yeah this is a short one because of that uh, i i just feel like there's just not gonna be a lot happening in this movie all things considered so uh here we go in a violent nature so the movie's available to rent um wherever you rent your movies on the apps and such like voodoo and stuff like that um i think it's going to be streaming on shutter sometime in the near future so if you're seeing this way past the upload date it's on shutter well you guys never heard of the white pine slaughter the what the white pine slaughter i thought that was the whole reason we were here it's gonna stay on this shot oh no we're moving we're moving we're moving slowly but moving whatever i'm leaving we're getting the lore dump We can't disturb the grave hey, Troy, you coming? of where a slaughter happened. Yeah. Because you're gonna wake him up. You disturbed his grave. You disturbed his resting spot. But now we all gotta face his wrath. Good job, buddy. Good job. I feel like I'm gonna be doing a lot of talking in this one, though. <laughs> all things considered. That's all, honestly though, I like that that's all I needed, was just a little bit of lore, like, hey, a massacre happened here, and don't touch that locket, and that's it, that's all I need. 
Oh my god, what it oh my god, oh my god, I just had a good idea, but I kinda don't want to say it out loud because I'm worried that somebody might take it from me. But you know, I'm gonna try to do it now, but I feel like it would be better if I like planned it out and write the bit for a future thing. But if somebody did like a like a nature documentary narration over this. Can he hear that well? They're so far away. How can he hear him? You got it lighten up. The killer stalking its prey. Come on inside. Take a load off. He sees his prey. He hears his prey from afar with his unnatural hearing capabilities. Wow. That guy got away by the hair on his chest. He got away. Oh, but he wants to follow the car for some reason. Oh, he's after the person in the car? Boy, there's a history in this man's injuries, too, by the way. You ever see a TV before? What year is it? Look at that TV. What What year is it? That was a pretty... Oh. This was your mother's, John. I want you to have it. That way it will always be with you, no matter what happens. You'll always be our little boy, John. His name's John. Okay. <laughs> I was thinking of that smiling friends bit. It's a little version of me, Alan. I want you to have it. Is that your locket? I don't think that's the right locket. That's a different locket. I'm about to. Yeah, I was expecting a loud shot. I told you what would happen if you came back here. You're gonna make me fucking do this. You stupid son. What the fuck, you? Oh, oh, something's happening. Okay, good. He doesn't want to use a gun. He's not like a certain clown that we were dealing with last week who has a gun for some reason. No, we're going for a chase in the woods. And you're going to take your time walking, aren't you? He's not a runner. He just woke up. He's still a little sore from all the sleeping, you know? Got to stretch them legs a bit. Oh, oh did he step in his own bear trap? Okay. All right. I like how we can infer everything that's happening. Because we're all so used to, like, seeing movies from the other angle that we're like, we can already tell what's going to happen to this guy. We don't have to see him run around and get caught in the bear trap. We already know he's going to. Oh. We're going for a bare hand kill this time, huh? I didn't do anything to you! No! Uh, what did you do? Number one motherfucker. Yeah, that ain't the right locket, dude. You killed the wrong man. Are you gonna t take his clothes, or... Oh, boy, that guy really had, like, a brand going, huh? The necklace and the hat? Was he, like, the, the CEO of number one motherfucker industries or something? Was the, sh was the shirt he's wearing also say number one motherfucker? Like, what's his deal? Because there's only one number one motherfucker, and sir, you are not Samuel L. Jackson. Night falls, and the prey, and, and night falls, and the predator spots another loud prey. The prey has given itself away, and the predator is now back on the prowl. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like sometimes it gets that big. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow, this is really yeah, my girl modern funny. Jason. Acting and all. Who <laughs> was that? The uh, slaughter thing. Oh, the white pine slaughter. One of you has the necklace! Wait, wait. Uh -huh. My uncle said it all started with this slow kid named Johnny. A slow kid? A slow kid that? named Johnny. Yeah. So, like, 70 years ago. Everywhere, miles in every I genuinely don't believe any of these people are actually friends. Oh, is he back there? Are you back there? Where are you? I see you! I see him! I see him back there. Okay. Yeah, there you are! I saw him. That's great. Oh, oh! I do, and I, I do appreciate that they are very cliche slasher victims. 
Like, they all have one personality trait each, you know? He's like, okay. Time to scheme, time to plot, time to think of some creative ways to get rid of these folks. Let me think. First, I gotta find a mask. Then, I gotta find some weaponry. I don't fucking care, he's bringing everyone down. Wow. Real nice, Troy. Real nice. Okay, I got the lore dump that I needed there. Did you guys at- he turns around looks at the camera, did you at home get all of that? Then let's keep him going, shall we? Follow me, why don't you? <laughs> He's like a Mr. Rogers, like... Come along with me on this adventure, why don't you? But when you get there, make sure you show them you're a really cool cassette player, because they'll think you're from the future. <laughs> He's like, I, I can't tell if, if Johnny's like... Um, Aaron's going to meet the- I'm really into this. Girls. I'm really into their oh, dynamics. He, is, is Johnny like watching a sitcom? Like, these guys should have a show. This is like How I Met Your Mother in the Woods. I also like their music taste. I'm gonna get a mix. I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Once I'm done with all of them, I'm gonna take a cassette or two. Hey, you wanna see a cool spider? Yeah. Do you wanna see a cool spider? Yeah? I'm so glad we are not following these people. I'm so glad we're following this man instead. Those people are insufferable. Thank God this movie's about you, sir. Hey, mister. Oh! Whoa! Through the mouth! Oh, good golly! Oh, goodness gracious! Oh, there it goes! I didn't think- oh, Ew, the tongue wiggling around! Ew, the tongue wiggling around! Okay, I was kind of under the impression this movie wouldn't show, but it showed. Are you gonna wear- are you gonna wear, like, the top half of his head like a hat? Are you gonna wear the top half of his head like a hat? Hey! He's- he's got the cassette player! You can get the cassettes! Do you even want to go in there? Oh, you're just going to throw the guy's head in there? Gross. Ah, wow, it landed right side up. That's good. And, uh... Oh, is that the mask? Firefighting. Drag hooks. What's a drag hook? Oh, is this your signature weapon? A drag hook? And an axe? I was hoping your signature weapon would just be the top half of that guy's head. <laughs> that is a weird looking mask. Kinda looks like- Are you just gonna hit the guy? <laughs> <laughs> yes siree. And we got our drag hook, whatever that is. It, oh. Somebody- Oh, my glasses are not gonna let me wear this mask the whole video. Now that the predator is in camouflage, it goes out again to hunt for more prey. This predator is has a keen eye and smartly does not need rest. I'm not getting a step wet. Are you gonna walk through the water? Are we gonna follow him underwater? Please tell us we follow him underwater. Really? That there's a shot of him just walking underwater. Make a move. Just don't waste my time with this high school bullshit. Well, that's good news because... How fast is he? He's not a very fast walker. You gals have time to flirt. Where are you? He walks past the... He walks past the Jason that's in there with the chain still. This is why I don't swim in lakes. You never know... Whoa! What? Like the end of Freddy vs. Jason when he just walks out the water holding Freddy's head. Yeah. Oh, no, it's just her body. Oh. Hey! Could you tell us what happened down there, sir? Fill us in. I like that I can honestly kind of just, like, build the movie in my head. You know what I mean? It's like showing you enough where you're like, okay... But then it doesn't show you enough where you could just like make your own Jason movie in your head. The time though. You weren't expecting this man though. Ah! Oh, be careful, you're gonna fall. Ma'am, you're gonna fall. Just jump! Oh, you just accepted your fate. You really just accepted it. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! You left the hook in her. Are you going to throw her off yourself? 
Ma'am, how are you still standing? Are you just processing that? Oh, no, we're gonna... Whoa, oh, oh! What? What's happening? This is a Mortal Kombat fatality by Versalwin. Whoa! How does that work? How does... Ow! Whoa! Is he gonna... Whoa! Whoa! Wait a second! Wait a second! That is a very strong... Not even the chain. That is a strong skull. That, ma'am, there's no way. There's no way. There's no way. Now that is a yoga trip. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. You see you do that, Art the Clown, you motherfucker. Holy jamoli. Ma'am, you, you, you could have just jumped and like broken an arm or something, but no. Now you got fucking human pretzeled. Holy shit. How the hell did they do that? Who even thinks of a kill like that? Okay, so he... he he. Okay, so I'm trying to like... That's like a Klein bottle. I'm still trying to figure out like the... the <laughs> okay, so... Okay, so, okay. Okay, this is her. Chain that way. No, okay, so chain from the back. Chain that way. She turns around. Chain on the head. And then he grabs this chain, and it's- wait, he turns around again? And then he grabs this chain, and then her head goes through the hole out the- I'm still- like, that is a- that is a mathematical equation I'm trying to figure out here. <laughs> oh boy! That's something I ain't never seen before. That's something- you- you would- you did this guy proud. You did this guy proud. He- he would be like- he would nod, you know? He'd be like, yeah. Yes. Yeah, you want this? <sighs> Go fucking get <laughs> I love that! He hit him with the keys! Oh, do you like keys? Do you like cars? Not keys, cars. Do you like car do you like keys? What are you a baby? You go Oh! Oh, he's just like a guy without a lips. He looks like a walking dead zombie. Actually, I really like his face. Like, the creature does- I don't- what? He's a handsome fellow, I'm sure. Prior to the dying. What fucking guy? I love him. I love him. Photo. I love this guy. Okay, look. You know what? A fair trade. Dead, a fun little- But he doesn't get to kill my whole fucking weekend, too! What the fuck did you just say? Did someone say dead dad? Uh, you, you reminded me of my goddamn trauma. You see what you did? I was having a nice time enjoying. Oh, and I crushed the car out of anger. Great. Well, there goes the final girl and boy. And you're left, jockey asshole. Guess what, sir? It's your turn. You know what? Let me just. Oh, he's setting a trap. Oh! He knows how to fight, though. Oh! Not that much, though. Whoa, who shot him? The guy inside. No, no, the other way. The other way. The other way. That way. Yeah, that guy. No, we don't use guns in this. Ow, that's why we don't use guns. Again, what a well-framed flick. I love the framing here. Oh, please tell me we stay in this. Please tell me we stay in this angle for the for the rest of the scene. Oh my god, we're staying in this angle for the rest of the scene! This is sick! This is like that John Wick angle. Oh, this is great. How'd you get him? In the back or the back of the head? Back of the head. Good aim. Wow, headshot and everything. I guess you're in a violent nature now, buddy. I don't know. I sh I'm glad I didn't write this movie. She's got the locket. Of course she does. Hey, buddy, use sign language. What? You don't have to resort to violence here. You can just skate. Chris, look out! Come on! You can just, you can just be like. Go, go, go! Let's go, go, go! He, he's gonna slash our throats. We gotta get out of here. <laughs> the necklace. The necklace. He's gonna choke us. We gotta get out of here. This guy's walking through a goddamn gorgeous uh, scenery here. 
I'm going to throw a Bob Ross calendar. You remember me? Not really. It's been a while. Wow, we're coming in on the sequel. I this is you. like Okay, so we're in the sequel technically. Or just give him the necklace back for Pete's sake. So you're gonna chain me up again, were you? All I wanted was the necklace. You could have just put the necklace down on my chest, but no. You wanted to chain me up. I'll chain you up. I'll chain you up. Oh shit, he paralyzed him. Jesus Christ, buddy. What are you, a chiropractor? How'd you know exactly where to pinch? Oh. Oh. I thought it was a wood chipper. This is worse. This is significantly worse than a wood chipper. Oh, we're gonna go limb by limb. I thought we were gonna go split in half. Ugh. It's the slowness of the thing that's really fucked up. It's how slow that thing is that's really... that's terrible. Buddy, you're giving the final girl and the guy a lot of time to get away. But you know what? You have a decade's worth of beef with this man. And a, a decade plus's worth of beef with his lineage, so I get it. I just want the necklace. I'm sorry about your friends, but let's be honest. You guys were not acting like friends. I know a toxic friend group when I see one, and... That was full of toxic behavior, alright? I've got to distract him. You go to the fire tower and set up the trap. I heard... It's the only way to stop him. I'll be back, I promise. Boy, I'm glad that nobody realized I have superhuman hearing. Like, considering this all goes by slasher tropes, and so far it has, in a, in a, in a neat way, um, usually at the end when they kill the... When, when he gets defeated, I assume they're gonna defeat him. There's always the fake out of the Come final on, girl. You look like son of a bitch! We're right! Great distraction, my guy. What a great distraction. Impressive. You're so good at distracting. Usually people would just throw a rock in a different direction. But you decided to sneak up within two feet of him. Are, are we done? Are we... Okay. He's just gonna make sure not even the dental records can get him, like, identify this guy. Jesus Christ. Take off the... F there we go. There we go. Smart gal. All that needed to be done. That's all that needed to be done. And just walk away. Just walk away. This is... He's still going, by the way. He's still going. Why are we following her now? We've never followed the, pre the people before. Now we're following her? Well, we're really following her. What a loud-ass forest. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. You guys wanted to camp out here? He's still chopping them? Also, how can she still hear him? How long has she been running? She ran like two feet. Are you his mom? You are we doing? Are we doing this? Limping up the road back there, goes deep into the forest. All the while, he's coming across fresh kill. Hey, real quick, how far is this hospital? I mean, this bear was eating him alive, and all ma'am, ma'am, was getting ma his face out of the water. Ma'am, time and place for this story. Ma'am, time and place for this story. He says, animals don't get too hung up on reason. Ma'am, can I ask you one more question? Just again, I hate to ask again, but how far is this hospital? Can we turn on the radio or something instead? I know you're scared, and you you went through something out there, and I don't pretend to know what it was. But ma'am, you're about to get got in the back of the head if you don't fucking listen to her. Let's go. Let's go. Get in the car and we'll go to the hospital, please. Please. Look at me. I'm not looking at you. I'm looking behind you. Keep an eye out. What's, what's over there? This was the fake out. It was a very long and drawn out fake out, but it was a fake out nonetheless. You got me there, movie. See, now that I don't, now that we're not following him, it, and I don't know where he is, the shots of nature become significantly more unnerving. 
Wait, are we looking at a bear trap? Is the necklace gone? No, he got it. He, he's got it. That's all he wanted. That's all he wanted. Yeah. 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 I mean, look, it, it, it's fun. I think I'm just kind of, I'm coming in after watching two movies that I did not enjoy at all. So coming into something like this feels like a breath of fresh air. I can see the, the problems people have with it. Um, I don't think it's slow. It's actually a pretty short movie. You people just have short attention spans. Uh, the problems I have are more with the everything but the the... <laughs> Like the the acting is is kind of eh, you know from and, and you could chalk it up to to saying oh but they're playing into it being like a like a like a cheesy Jason movie they're acting like they're in a cheesy Jason movie and it's like yeah but they could do better at that too and uh, I think the third act kind of fumbles it in in a way that I, I almost hurts the rest of the movie honestly. Um... Like, I understand what they're doing, because it's like, you know, she puts the necklace down, leaves, and then completely, for the last 20 minutes, perspective switches to her. But I would have preferred if we kind of just stayed on him until he kind of just buries himself back up again, you know? I, I, I think that that's the more... Because then we're now we're following somebody who we just barely get to know, you know? We're, we're following somebody that's just... Uh, not that I'm rooting for the killer or anything. I mean, I, 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 it's just not what I wanted to see at the end. You know, I get what they were going for. Like then the nature is violent. It's a violent nature. No, but <laughs> it's I, I like, I get it. And um, that lady's monologue was really long. And you know what? Good, good on her for doing that whole ass monologue in the car like that. That was a very, that was like a ten page fucking monologue she was doing. But um, I I do enjoy that when she looks out into the woods and you can't tell if he's still there or not. I guess that's why they wanted to do that. But you could have done that in a shorter amount of time, you know. You could have done that in a shorter amount of time. And I still don't understand that whole part of her running in the woods and and she kept like running in circles and stuff. I I don't know. I still have to maybe ponder and, and, and formulate a bit more on that uh, if I can. Or when the camera gets all floaty when the lady's picking her up and she like looks into the camera for a moment. It, it, it's stuff like that that's fascinating. But the, the rest of it, I was like, can we just get back to the guy? But then, you know, he's gone. He got his necklace. That's all he wanted. Um, but yeah, I it's it's a it's 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 a it's a choose your own adventure Jason movie. That's all it is, you know? It, it gives you, like, the bare bones of, like, the very faint outline of a movie like a Jason movie. Um, and then it holds back enough for you to just formulate the movie in your head. And if you watch enough of these, you kind of can formulate a whole ass movie in your head with just what they give you here. Which is neat, I think. I find it neat. I, I can see how some people are impatient about it, but I'm like, dude, I, it's, it's a Jason movie that you make in your head. Except for the kills. Those are all laid out for you. But what kills are they? Like, th boy, they are some kills. I'll tell you what. Holy jamolis. Did I rewind that one kill? Yes, I did. I'm still, I still can't comprehend it. I still can't even think how somebody could think of something. Like, just then... Oh, the, that's it's uh, like I don't even know how that works. That's another one for the MythBusters if they ever choose to reunite. Um, and then th that other kill, with, I, I would say that that kill with the log thing kind of went on too long and was very loud. Um, like we got it, dude. We know what you're gonna do with the log thing. You don't have to like draw that out. Uh, saw a kill, pretty cool. Um, you you see you seen one of those. You have seen all of those though. Um, and the the other ones are pretty good in in the way they were framed. I would say the the best part of this movie is is two things: the sound design and the framing. Because I love the the sound design. No music, just nature sounds, and very well done nature sounds. And 
and you know you could hear the the dialogue and all that fine enough and but you could also hear the nature kind of drowning things out that's good the framing is really great i kind of love how we stay on the back of his head for most of it um the movie's kind of inconsistent with itself and i say that's another problem it has um i kind of wish it was all from the back of his head i mean i'm fine that they show his face and all that but i do wish it was all just like that one angle if the movie was all just the one angle from behind like that it would be pretty neat it's pretty neat and then um what was the other thing i was gonna say the mask is pretty cool the, the design of the guy pretty cool uh i would say i'm kind of shocked has, has nobody ever used that mask before because that's a real thing i looked it up that's a real that's what firefighter masks look like kind of shocked nobody's used that in a, in a scary movie yet somebody had to have that's a scary ass mask um but 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 the framing i i say is, is fantastic i love the framing especially the scene where where the guy shoots him and he he's dead on the floor and he's trying to help the other guy up and like the the body is like at the at the the he takes up the lower third of the screen it's really neat i really like that um yeah i i, I don't know i had a good time with it it was fun it was in a fun nature for me <laughs> Yeah, but yeah, what would you guys think? Did you guys uh, get bored or did you guys have fun formulating the things in your head, letting your imagination run wild with the movie that lets you? Let me know in the comments. And if you want to see the full uncut reaction, uh, patreon.com slash bsmovies where you can get that and so much more for a dollar a month. And until next time, remember, don't do yoga in front of a cliff because you're cornered. And then you're giving the killer ideas when you're doing yoga. God damn. That lady. Pff. Look, I got like sometimes I wake up uh, with, with with back problems. I'm like, I wish somebody would just like stretch my neck out or something. But not like that. Not like that.